Stop doing this to sign digital paper. First sign on a white paper, choose the best one and crop it. Now go to channels, select red channel and duplicate it. And then go to image menu, adjustments and curves. Now adjust the curve until you get the best result. After adjusting the curve, hit OK and load channel as a selection. Now delete the red copy and go back to layer panel. Select the selection tool, right click and choose select inverse. Now create solid color adjustment layer with any color you want. Delete the background layer and we are done. Save it as a PNG or you can copy and paste this signature anywhere you want. How to create a mockups for a cylindrical object in Photoshop? Use Ctrl plus T to free transform. Right click and select warp. Go to warp option and choose cylinder. Decrease the opacity of design layer to make it easier. Now align mockup with the can like this. Hit enter. Go to layer panel and now increase the opacity. Change the blending mode normal to multiply. And this is how we can create a mockup for cylindrical object. To create a black and white portrait with a color effect in Photoshop, begin by creating a black and white adjustment layer for a colorful image. Next create a hue saturation adjustment layer and tick the colorize option. Adjust the saturation and hue to your preference. Invert the layer mask by using shortcut key Ctrl plus I. Use a selection tool to select the t-shirt. And invert the mask again. Next, select the brush tool, make foreground color white and start painting over the eyes. Remove any excess color by switching to black foreground color. Do the same with other eyes. After that, create a curves adjustment layer, select the strong contrast from the preset, adjust the curves point, add some text if you want and this is how we can make black and white with a Stop doing this to make spotlight. First, go to layer panel and create a new layer. And then select the rectangular marquee tool from the tools panel. Make a selection like this and select gradient from tools panel. Fill the selection with gradient like this. After that, use shortcut key Ctrl plus C to free transform. Right click and select distort. Now adjust the light like this. Now go to filter menu, blur and gaussian blur. Write the value you want and hit ok. And that's it. With these simple shapes you can easily create a spotlight effect.
Don't simply brush over the text you want to erase from the picture. Instead, select Lasso tool from the toolbar. Make a selection around all the text while holding the shift key. Next, go to select menu and color range. Select shadow, adjust the fuzziness and range and click OK. Again, go to select menu, modify and expand. Adjust the value and click OK. Now there is two ways to do it. First, right click and select delete and fill selection. Second way is go to edit menu and choose contain aware fill. And there you go. This is how you can remove text from the picture in photo. How to fix low resolution logo. First go to image menu and image size. Now increase the image size by 2000 pixels. After that, go to Edit Menu, Preference and Technology Previews. Now check the Enable Content Over Tracing tool if uncheck. Hit OK and restart Photoshop. After that, go to Toolbar and select Content Over Tracing tool. Now easily trace the logo like this. Create solid color adjustment layer and select any color you want. Do the same with others. And here we go, follow for more.